Good day, ma. My name is Pabas Ang Castillo, Group 17 from Davao Doctors College. So now I'm going to demonstrate perineal washing. The purpose of this is to prevent or eliminate infection, odor, and promote healing and remove secretion and provide comfort. So now we have basin, warm water, gloves, um, perineal pad or bed sheet, um, um, cotton balls with betadine, cotton balls, clean cotton balls, alcohol. So now we're going to wash hands and to to save time and effort. So we have to prepare also the materials. So we have alcohol. Then apply for gloves. I'm done applying sterile gloves. So next, we're going to screen the patient or lock the doors of the patient room so that we can provide privacy and lessen the risk that someone will enter the procedure is being performed. So next, we're going to introduce yourself and explain the procedure to the patient so that the patient know the know that she can understand and gain the patient cooperation. So, hi ma'am. Ako tayo si Pebo San Castillo, yung mga students nurse ko rin adlawa. So, naate ko diri para mag-perennial wash kay para malisin na to ang inyong odor o para na kay comfort. So, okay lang kasi mo ha ma'am. Then, put a patient on bed pan and drape the patient exposing only the part to be cleansed. So and identifies abscess, abscesses, abscesses, and assist the So this is to provide the minimum exposure, lessen the embarrassment, and when provide and to provide warmth the patient. So now we're going to position the patient on the dorsal recumbent to allow to allow the visual on the perineal area. Then inspect the perineum, then flush the perineal area with a warm water. Um, note for the particular areas of inflammation and swelling excessive discharge or secretion from the urethra and presence of odor then warm water is used to prevent chilling and soften or dissolve the blood clots so get cotton balls soaked in a clean solution using the pick up forcep then external genitalia using working forcep starting from the mons pubis down to the anus never trace a stroke so that to prevent um contamination from mons pubis to labia majora to the anus then moons pubis again to labia minora to anus. Then do likewise on the opposite side with the next cotton balls. With the third cotton balls, clean starting from moons pubis in the figure seven by the way of internal labium towards the anus discard. Then, clean external genitalia from midline of Simpson's pubis down to the anus, never retrace a stroke to prevent contamination of the area. A moon's pubis down to vagina, urethral opening to anus. 
Then clean the growing area. To anus. Then flush the perineum tree with sterile water. Sterile warm water. Using a dry cotton ball, dry the perineum with the same stroke as above. To moisture support the growth of many microorganisms. Mental vestula via manora to anus. Um, one for this to ritual happening to anus. Then from growing, growing. Then remove the bread pan gently and turn the patient to to the side. So, ma'am, how many na data, ma'am ha? Turn patient on her back and make her comfortable. So, ma'am, how many na data, ma'am ha? So if necessary, put a perennial pad. Then do after care of the materials, use wash hands, then record the treatment done to patient and discharge observed. For documentation, the purposes that the procedure is was done and means of communication. So, ma'am, thank you guys for your cooperation, ma'am. Mananagta, salamat. That's all.